Hello, welcome to freeexcellearn.com. This is my Excel video tutorial number 16. Here I am on last coding stage of user form with multi column list box as like grid tutorial. So let's go to the task Visual Basic and sorry Visual Basic and just click on Project Explorer user form 2. Here I will write the code under this command button. Okay. But uh, it remarks that before write this code, I want to tell about the total task of uh, under this button. Okay, when I click this box, before click this box, I will fill up these three text box, and after that, I will click this common button. And to click this common button, it will uh, this data will go to this sheet, and after that this sheet data will come to this list box okay so this is our task way so i am not i am now going to write code under this common button so let's go for write remarks something that yeah, declare for variable and ero okay so dim ero a as integer dim a ro as integer Okay, I am now write the code of ero ero a sorry ero a equal to application. So just I am taking the code and paste it to here as it is good for my tutorial. Okay. After that, I will give that condition. Which condition? Just see. Condition for uh, for not e m p t y m t text box. Okay. Condition for not empty text box. That means no em text box will be empty. So the condition will be me dot text box as there is text box three. So we will mention here all of the text box. Okay. Dot value dot value equal to blank. That is and so i mentioned here that uh, no text box will be mentioned here uh, no, no no text box will be empty here sorry and if it will empty then message box message box p l e a s e please please input data properly okay after that i will give a set focus that means set focus will be text box one because it is the first text box and for this uh, the cursor what what you see there the cursor is blinking uh, in the same way the cursor will be blinking on text box one so for this i write this code and after that else it is fill up uh, properly then 
the condition the next condition will be apply here and if I just end the condition okay on this condition I will do something that is here I will first pass the data from text box to sheet okay for this the remarks will be text box data pass to SH, SHWT sheet 1 okay and the code will be SHWT sheet 1 dot C E L L S cells cells will be cells will be E row A E row A and column will be A okay and dot value will its property and it come from okay I am just uh, telling you something that E row A I will discuss it you later SHWT sheet 1 dot C E okay just I'm copy this I'm copy this and paste it to here and here I will pass the data of B and for this section the data will be go from txt text box 1 dot value okay okay and on in the same way the rest of the value will be passed from text column 1 and text column 2 and it will go to a b c d and I will discuss it later in just a few minutes and after that uh, the data is now in sheet 1 and what I will do I will uh, now see data on list box okay so for this I have to write a for loop and before that I have to clear the text box must remember that you have to clear the text box so for this I uh, write the code clear clear the list box otherwise it its uh, row will be increases or uh, that there may be some problem okay so just I am clear that list box list box dot C L E R clear properties okay and now and now I am going to write a loop so the remarks will be run loop okay so here I declare the position of a row equal to 2 I will also discuss it later and just going for write the loop and the loop will start from 0 to e row a and 2 will be deduction from here and end the loop okay in this loop what will I add I will add data from Excel sheet so our uh, for adding list box data I have to write me dot list box one dot add item it will mandatory mandatory okay and after that I am going for show or add list data uh, add list box data from sheet okay so list box list box one and the position will be list and list position will be a start of loop and the column will be zero okay and it will call uh, it will come from SSWT sheet one dot C E L L S cells cells a row comma 
एरो कॉमा ए ओके ओके ऑन द सेम वे आई जस्ट फिल अप दिस दिस दैट मींस द डाटा ऑफ बी कॉलम विल बी लिस्ट बॉक्स दिस सेल on the same way it will be continue and after that i will increase the a row a row that is a row equal to a row a row plus 1 okay and this is the end of my loop okay and after that i have to clear all the text box data so the remarks will be for clear clear all text box data data and the code is me dot text box one dot value equal to free and on the same way okay and after all everything I will I will uh, set focus on text box one okay so the remarks will be for smoothly task me dot text box one dot set focus okay uh, set focus okay let uh, okay i finish my tax of to write the code under this common button okay i'm just telling you how i uh, here i in previous i did not mention something that is uh, the main was e row a the e row a is the our last uh, cell condition or row condition and by this row condition i will just input this e row here so it will become a serial number see that if i input something here i uh, it will be serial number 4 on the same way Uh, I just a row, sorry, a row, and this a row is the cell row number. Okay, so for this, I write a row code here, and it is needed here. Okay, I'm just running the form. And just I am a yeah, input here Ishan, Ishan, and age is seven, and address is Dhaka. So I click on this button and it go to here. After that, it came to list box. And this is the addition way of data from sheet to list box. Okay. Thank you for watching. Okay.